It's beautiful up here, isn't it? I love this. It makes me realize how lucky I am. Stop. Devin, I... Uh... Alexis and Chambers. I loved you from the first moment that I saw you. Devin, please. Will you marry me? I, uh... I don't know what to say. Yes, this is where you say yes. Devin, I'm not ready to get married. Or even engaged. I'm sorry. But we, we love each other. I'm going off to college. Okay, well, if it's a distance, I'll go with you. I'll, I'll work whatever job. I'll make coffee, I'll, I'll, I'll scrub toilets. We need to be together. I think we need to live our own lives for a while. And this doesn't mean it ends forever, okay? I don't believe this. I think this would be good for me. For us. This is a mistake. Devin, you know how much I care about you. You're gonna be okay. Obviously, I had my pick of offers from all over the country. Obviously. That's what happens when you navigate the launch of a successful IPO. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? I took the one that was closest to my family. Because family is everything. It's only a two-hour flight to Seattle, so, you know, I'm chilling with the sis and her kids and the rents, as the kids say these days. <laughs> oh, the kids actually don't say that. Well, uh, now what about you? It's almost like I'm doing all the talking here. Oh, well you are, but that's hey, okay. Mom. Hey, sweetheart. Sorry I followed you guys, but I couldn't help it. I just wanted to meet my new dad. New dad? She's so excited about you. Mom says you're the one. Oh, really? <laughs> 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 Yeah, that was supposed to be between us, our little secret. This, that's my office. You know, why don't, why don't you two, uh... Yeah, you should go. Bye, Dad. <laughs> I'm gonna miss him. <laughs> that was a nice performance. I thought you were just gonna say you needed a ride to band practice. Oh, well, he looked like an a-hole, so I wanted to scare him off. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there are sites just for widows to meet widowers. Ew, that's... Oh no. Ew. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I have to just check this in case it's work. Wait, it's actually your school. Midterm grades are out. Oh. Wait, is there anything you want to tell me before I look at this? Just that you should love me, no matter what, because I am your only child. Uh-oh. Oh my god. Why do you still have a D? You still have a D? You said you were gonna bring that up. Look, that was the plan, okay? It, it's just chemistry, it's not a big deal. It's a big deal. It's gonna affect your final grade and your ability to get into a good college. Okay, well if I don't, then, then I'll get a job and I'll work on my music. Okay, so that was plan B. Plan A, remember, is that you are going to bring this grade up, sweetheart, please, so that you can have the most options to get into the best college, okay? Fine. Agreed. Really? Yeah. Oh. Great, because I hired a tutor. What? Mother. It's going to be great. Mrs. Fielding said that this amazing woman, Karina Ayers, she's a retired teacher, is the best tutor ever. Come on, it's not that bad. She sounds really nice, <sighs> and she said that she can see you Tuesday morning before school. <gasps> you said that before you even knew my grade. Yeah. It's my plan B. Oh, I can't believe you did this. Very sneaky. 
Hmm. Okay. I will agree to this without a fight if you do something for me. Okay, what? Sign up for online dating. All right, I'll do it. Great. I'm gonna set up your profile as soon as we get home. I didn't mean I would really do it. Hold on. Tutor, where do you live? Oh, I know where that is. Come on, focus. We are behind. The night crew didn't get through all the Kelvin panels, and we need these ASAP. Sure, sorry. Just go, okay? Go. Please. We just got a requisition for the Winslow panels to be turned around ASAP. Uh, what were you doing back here? Oh, I was just organizing some lab equipment. Do you want to check my work? I'll check it later. Okay. Oh, I wanted to take a personal day tomorrow. Do you know anyone looking to cover a shift at all? Oh, please, let me just uh, stop everything I'm doing and make some calls. Thank you.
think Miss Ayers is here. Uh. Hi, Miss Ayers. Oh, that would be me. <laughs> or is it I? I and me, I never could keep those two straight. Uh, but then I'm here for chemistry, not English, right? <laughs> yeah, are you okay? I guess I'm still waking up. I, I should add another cup of coffee. Oh, I I'm sorry. Uh oh, were you saying something? I wasn't. Well, somebody was talking, weren't they? Nice job, Mom. Top notch. I can really feel that A. Do me a favor and go inside right now. Okay, get your stuff together. Hi. I really appreciate you coming by today. We actually just decided to go with someone else. <laughs> you have? Yeah. Huh? I don't know. Maybe you don't want to drive anymore today. Should I call someone for you? I just... I think I'm gonna take a walk. Looks like it's gonna be a beautiful day. Armstrong Dental, how may I help you? Hi, hi, good morning. I was hoping to make an appointment later today. Is this an emergency? Uh, does it have to be? Well, if it's just for a cleaning, she's booked for about two months. Oh, yeah, well, this is, this is definitely an emergency. Okay, what's wrong? Um, you know, I, I, I cracked my tooth and I'm, I'm in tremendous pain. Okay, can you be here before noon? Absolutely, absolutely. My name, my name is Devin Fletch, by the way. Devin Fletch, okay. Got it. Okay, we will see you then. Okay, thanks, bye. Feeling a little weird. It'll take about an hour for the Novocaine to wear off. Oh, well, I, I appreciate you seeing, seeing me so early. Yeah, I'm glad it worked out. So just be careful with biting down on anything. Yeah, I'll never trust the word seedless ever again. <laughs> What's that, Mulford Labs? Oh, we do um, chemical testing and analysis. Hmm. My daughter's actually struggling in her chem class right now. Mm. You have any tips? Um, yeah, you know, I always tell my students that they should Are you have students? Yeah, I'm a tutor. <laughs> I have all kinds of tricks, outlines, and flashcards. Interesting. Do you have any um, spaces open for tutoring right now? Um, you know, I'm pretty booked up this semester. Oh. But you were so good getting me in this morning, so if you want, I can, I can make it work for you. Really? That would be great. Do you have uh, references? Yeah, you know what? I have a card. I'm gonna just get it. Um, this goes to my website, has all my contact information in there. Perfect. Just, you know, give me a call if you're interested. Okay, I will. Mm.
That was awesome, everybody. Uh, one more? Uh, I'm tapped. Well, you know, just a few more practices and uh, we'll be ready. Ready for what? There's a studio holding a new band showcase. Uh, we've only ever played in your garage. Not even for our parents, man. My mom's butthurt about that. She really wants to hear something. Plus, we don't even have a name. Well, I already signed us up. What? Dude. Easy, easy. I, I thought, you know, as the founder and the manager, I'd make those decisions. It would have been cool if you asked us first. Duh. But... All right. Yes. Practice tomorrow? In. In. Crap, I'm out. My mom is making me meet another tutor. Maybe after? I'll see what I can do. Hey. Hey. Miss Armstrong, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, good. How's your tooth? Uh, you know, it's it's almost 100%. That's really good news. Yeah. Yeah, come on in. Oh, thanks. Yeah. <clears throat> this, is a, this is a nice place. Thank you. The music? That's Emily. Oh. Wow, she's, she's really good. She is. The band will be your um, biggest competition, though, when it comes to tutoring. But um, oh, okay. why don't I go get her? Yeah. I'll be right back. OK. Here she is. <laughs> it's a pleasure meeting you, Emily. <laughs> Suits a bit much. No, you're not gonna be rude right now. Um, so, uh, I hear you're having some problems with your chem class. That's what they tell me. What specifically do you seem to be struggling with? All. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, what is your class currently focused on? I don't know, they're, they're talking about, like, mass and stuff. Okay, so conservation of mass, mass into action, et cetera. That sounds familiar. Well, you're in luck, because that just happens to be my specialty. Oh. Um, sweetie, why don't you go get that assignment? Uh, before we get started, do you mind if I use the restroom? Yeah, of course. Um, right upstairs, you can use the master bathroom. Okay, got it. Thanks, okay. thanks. <laughs> It'll do. <sighs> Stupid! Stupid! All right, how we doing? Did you get on the ammonia equation? Okay, uh, almost. You just 
You forgot to carry the coefficient. All this lingo, it doesn't make sense to me. You're a musician, right? I heard you playing when we got here. What does that have to do with anything? It, for chemical reactions to work, they have to sync up just like a, like a good song. Okay, so in this case, think of, think of hydrogen as lyrics and nitrogen as melody. All right, just listen, this, this equation, it is imbalanced. And when an imbalance occurs, you use a coefficient and it balances it out. Think of coefficients as like a killer guitar solo. That's it. That's actually really good. <laughs> oh my god, it worked? Yeah. I got it! Hello? Hey, hey. I've been working on a new song. It's just for you. Really? Hey, you have to stay hey. here then. You guys taking a little break? Oh, she is a visitor. Hey. Really? Oh, hey. Hey. Uh, this is Emily's tutor, Devin. Well, I thought her tutor would be like an old lady or something. <laughs> uh, sweetie, you can't have guests while you're studying, okay? Oh, we're done. Is that right? Yes, actually, <laughs> we are. Yeah, you know, we had a really productive first meeting. Well, that's great. <laughs> yeah, I invited Steve to stay for dinner. We're just gonna go set up and work on some chords and stuff. Oh, okay. I can't wait to hear this song. <laughs> So how bad is it? She's smart. She won't have any problems grasping the concepts with just a little bit more work. It just needs to happen by midterms, is that possible? And she needs to focus and just block everything else out. Okay, so maybe she just needs to put band practice off for a little bit. I'll have to break that news to her. What news? Oh, uh, just we'll talk about it later. What's the big secret? Just tell me. Just that until midterms are over, we're thinking you should cut back on other things. You mean the band? Miss Armstrong. Yeah, just for a little while. Did you make her say this? No. I, this is my decision. We're um, not going to have an argument about it right now, OK, sweetie? Then don't make me do it. Let's have a private conversation, me and you upstairs. We're just gonna go upstairs. Mom. Upstairs. <sighs> Sorry guys, you can let yourselves out. Mom! I saw the way you were looking at her. What? It's okay. She's kinda hot. I know what you're talking about, man. I'm her tutor. Whatever, man. I don't know what else to say. This is so stupid! Okay, first of all, academics are not stupid. I'm not asking you, sweetheart, to give up music for the rest of your life. I'm just saying put it aside for a few weeks. But they are counting on me. Who's counting on you? You're playing in Steve's garage. No, we're not. Steve found a studio that is putting on a new band showcase. Well, that's going to have to wait. Mom! Trust me, there will be other showcases. Oh, you cannot do this! I can do it, and I am doing it. You have to wait till midterms are over, and then you can go back to the band. This is so unfair! It's very reasonable. I'm being very reasonable! No, you're being completely unreasonable! This is my shot! So did you get your mom to cave? We gotta practice. I know. Well, can you sneak away anyways? I have the tutor tonight, but maybe he can cover for me. Doubt it. That guy's into you. He wants you all to himself. You're so full of it. Well, if you say so, when can you sneak away? I mean, technically after my tutor session tonight, my mom's got a date, but by the time I get to your house, that puts me in the police getting called window. But I think I can work with that. She's in your office. Okay, thanks. Uh... Hey. 
okay? Mm, you okay? Don't feel good. You don't feel warm. Oh, um, there's a there's a bug going around school. Like, like half the school is out today. Hmm. Maybe I should stay home with you. No, I'll be all right. I just I just want to go home, do my homework, and go to sleep. Oh well, what about tutoring? Can we postpone? Just reschedule for the weekend. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, mom. You're the best. Okay. Feel better, sweetie. <coughs> This is Devin. Hi, Devin. Um, listen, Emily's not feeling well today, so we are going to cancel the session. I'm really sorry for the short notice. Oh, yeah. No, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, I, I hope she feels better. Thanks. We'll see you Saturday. Oh, okay. yourself you'll feel better hey you okay mm, meh yeah you know what I'm gonna cancel no yes. mom no please go have fun mm. oh he is texting me all right will you go to bed early you promise, promise? <laughs> okay <laughs> love you I love you bye five years old and she wanted to have a very serious talk with me about her relationship with Mr. Bunny, her stuffed rabbit, and how she feels they should get married. And I just told her that I think it's a little soon and she should wait till she's older. And she actually agreed with me. Then she went behind my back and married Mr. Bunny anyway. <laughs> well, she has a mind of her own. Yes, I don't know where she got that from. You want to see a picture of her? Yeah. She looks just like you. I bet she's smart. She's uh, she's really smart. She's having a little trouble right now with her chem grade, and I'm worried it's going to affect her ability to get into the college she likes. Well, you know I don't have kids, but I do hang out with my brother and sister's families a lot. Hmm. And uh, at some point, you just have to let them loose, let them go do what they got to do. But don't worry, because they never stray too far and they always come back. Cheers to that. Cheers. This was fun. Yes. If we get to do this again, can we do something maybe a little more formal, like possibly eating? I would love that. This weekend? Or is it too soon? That's perfect. Yeah. yeah. That's our best session yet. You say that after every practice. Because it's true. We're getting better and better. You know, we're going to nail the showcase, get signed, 
tour the country and then the world. And you're going to be a star. Mm. <sighs> hey, I was uh, thinking about grabbing some Johnnies. Oh, rain check. I am already pushing it as it is. My mom's going to kill me if I'm not back before her. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I just need a minute. <sighs> hey. Mom, I am so sorry. I should never Listen. have... You lied to me. Here we are, right? You know, it just took everything in me to not ground you until graduation or take something precious away from you, like your guitar. But then I realized that the reason why I want to do that is because I feel like you've taken something precious away from me tonight. And this is just not about me anymore. This is about you. Obviously, you have to graduate from high school, but you're free to do with your free time what you see fit. The band, studying. Because I need to know that you're not lying to me. So don't lie to me, okay? From this point forward, your grades are your responsibility. So all on you now. I am going to keep practicing with the band. Okay, well, if that's what you've decided. And I'd also like to keep doing the tutoring sessions because I think they're really helping. Okay. Good night. Good night. Glad to see you're up and about. Oh, that. Yeah, I completely made that up. You did? Yep, uh, went to band practice instead. Mm. Should you be talking about it so openly? Oh, yeah, she knows. I totally got busted. How much trouble did you get in? Not any, really. Really? Ah, my parents would have killed me and then banned me from ever playing in that band again. <laughs> yeah, you think so? I mean, she hated that I lied to her, but she knows that I'm an adult and I should be making my own decisions. Mm, how progressive of her. <laughs> my students' parents would not have been as open-minded. <sighs> I need an iced tea. Yeah, yeah, you're right. This is a good time for a break. God, you're a Vertigo fan? No, no, I've just seen him live like 20 times. So what's your favorite tune? 
Tune, you know, song, Vertigo. Hey, oh, who has Vertigo? No, no, oh no, it's Valens. Valens is the combination of elements when they form chemical molecules, combining to make chemical compounds. Very nice. So uh, Emily tells me you have a big date tonight. No, I do not. We're just, you know, taking things slow and easy. Anyway, so... Oh, I might not be here when you get back. Oh, okay, where are you going? Just to Johnny's with Steve. Just the two of you? Yep. Okay, well, don't be home too late. I won't if you won't. I'll take that deal. <laughs> so funny because my first instinct was to lock her in a box and, you know, throw away the key as they say, and then I realized it's your fault that I didn't. Why my fault? I actually couldn't get our conversation out of my head, and you were right. I just I need to start trusting her. You know, she's going to do what she wants anyway, and I really want her to be accountable for her own actions. Hmm. You're right. I do deserve a lot of the credit. <laughs> Welcome to Johnny's. Hi. Just one? Um, yeah, just one. And do you know where the men's restroom is? Uh, yeah, it's in the back and to the right. Great. Okay, thanks. Uh -huh. Hey, welcome to Johnny's. Two? Yeah, just two. All right. Oh my God, look at that picture. I'll show you the way. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. I know, right? What are you gonna get tonight? Uh, I usually just get pepperoni, honestly. What? Boring. What about you? Supreme, baby. Thanks. Uh, I'll take a Sprite and she'll have an iced tea. Uh, I can order for myself. <laughs> I will have an iced tea with a lime, please. Singer. Stop. Thanks, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Mm. Well, I think Landon and Tanya would be okay with it. I'm certainly okay with it. <laughs> uh, excuse me. It's true. Yeah. Are you ready? I'm ready uh, for a menu. Sure. It's going to be great. I can't wait. Let's not let anything ever come between us. We're a team, always. So imagine that, like going around the country, from state to state, we have seen everything. Are you okay? God, I'm feeling, I'm feeling really tired. Whoa! whoa. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, let me um, let me get a it's towel okay. or something. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Dude. All right, excuse me, miss. You know what? I'd let like me, to. Just... Okay, what can I get? Emily. Oh my god. Emily? Emily, are you okay? Is anyone on? Yes, hi. I work at Johnny's. Yes, the one close to Rossmore. Um, we have a patron. She's on the floor. I think she's sick or something. 
Excuse me, excuse me, miss. What? What? I'm, I'm not trying to get anyone in trouble, but I saw that girl's date. He put something in her drink. Oh my god. Um, patron's just saying that he saw her date put something in her drink? Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. Isn't this lovely? Emily, it's, it's gonna be okay. Mr. Garson. Can you tell me what this is? I, I don't know, I've never seen that before. Turn around, son, you're under arrest. What? That's, that's not mine. You have the right to remain silent. Let go! Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court law. Emily, I didn't do this! You have the right to an attorney and to have an Emily! attorney present during questioning. Emily! Adios, Steve. Wait, where are you from? I'll be right there. I have to go, my daughter's in the hospital. What? I'll drive you. Hey, sweetie. Mom, you're okay. Listen, sweetheart. Um... They think somebody drugged you. What? They think it was Steve. Uh, no. Someone saw Steve put drugs in your drink and then they found drugs in Steve's car later on. Do you know anything about that? I don't believe that. I don't either. It's okay. You don't worry about it. They're gonna do some tests and I'll handle it. Okay. You go back to sleep. Is there any way that could be a mistake, or? I... Yes, of course, I, I, of course, yes, of course, yes. Let us know if you have any more questions. Thank you. Who was that? Oh, uh, <sighs> uh, that was the police. Your test results came back. The drug that was in your system, um, sweetie, it's basically, it's a date rape drug. And it's the same drug they found in Steve's car. I can't believe it. How could he do this to me? We've been, we've been best friends since fifth grade. I know, it's devastating when someone betrays you like that, but you never know what's going on with people. You know, maybe something with his family. People are, uh, people are really good at hiding things. You know? Yeah, I know that now. <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> so much for the ban, right? <laughs> Who needs it? Um, I guess there is nothing left for me to do but study for that stupid midterm. <laughs> Yay! Hey, Mom. Hey, sweetheart. Um, I'm stuck at the office. Is that a big deal? Well, I'm just not gonna get home until after Devin gets there. I can handle myself, Mom. No, I just didn't know with everything that's been going on, you know. I'll be home as soon as I can. Okay. Love you. Love you. I don't think I'm gonna stick with the music. What? No, you're too talented and it's your passion, isn't it? 
Steve was always the driving force of everything. Okay, well now you'll be the driving force. And you'll see that people will be there for you. Like who? Me, for one. Yeah. No, I have an agent friend, a music agent, and I've already told him about you. You did? Yes. And he said he was interested, and he wants to hear something. The only thing is, he wants a demo reel. Do you have one? No. Okay, well, when you get one together, just give it to me and I'll pass it along. All right, let's get back to your assignment. We could do something now. What? A demo. No, we can't do something now. Let, maybe later, let's just study for now, No, okay? now is the perfect time because my mom is stuck at the office. Yeah, but I don't have anything to record on. Well, do you have a phone? I, I mean, do you think you'd be okay with that? I don't know, I mean, I'd have to ask him. Please, yeah. please. Okay, do you have a small room with good acoustics? Yeah. <clears throat> it's uh, pretty quiet in here. And this, this might work. You ready? Yeah, just one second. What'd you think? That was, that was really something special. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh crap, my mom, you cannot be in here, come on. still here, huh? Yeah, we're just finishing up. I think you're going to do really well on the test tomorrow. I think you're right. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yo. Yo. So, they kicked you out for, like, good? Yeah. Put me on some kind of a list. Can't go near the school. Can't go near Emily ever again, either. She put a restraining order on me. You know I didn't do this, right? Who do you think did it then? I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. You should let the police or your lawyer do that, bro. The police think I'm a criminal. My lawyer wants me to plead. Screw that. Hey, you want to hang? Play something? Nah, man. I, I can't. I just came to grab the rest of my stuff. You said you believed me. I do, but... Just take it and get out. And don't expect me to accept your apology when I find out who did this.
I hope you studied for this, Emily. Your mom's in her office. What? Oh my gosh! That's so great! I'm so proud of you! Wow, Devin's really working out, huh? Wow, you really know how to kill a girl's high. I worked really hard for that, you know. Yes, that's why I said I'm so proud of you. Thanks. This is good. This is really good. Now I'm scared you're not gonna need me anymore. Nonsense! Now I want an A on the final. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> oh, by the way, I have some good news for you. I spoke to my agent friend, and he liked what he heard. Shut up. <laughs> the thing is, though, he, he wants a professional demo reel. And if you want, I can set you up with the arrangements, get you the space. No, no, you don't have to do that. I mean, you've already done so much. No, but it, it'd be my pleasure because I believe in you. There's just, there's, there's one other thing. Oh, I don't do auto-tune. No, no. He's looking for a very specific look. A more all-American, classic look. He still believes in you, though. I thought that my music would stand on its own. No, and it does. It does stand on its own. It's just, you don't want to give him a reason to say no. Look, just think about it, and if you're into it, I can pick you up here tomorrow when you're done with school, and we can go. It's our secret. Our secret. Kitchen's closed. What are you doing here? I didn't do this. You better leave or I'm calling the police. No, please, please, no. I don't know how this happened. One minute I'm here on the first date with my best friend, and the next thing I know I'm being arrested for trying to drug her. You said you saw me, but I didn't do it. I never said I saw you. You didn't? Then, then how? Look, after your friend collapsed and I was on the phone with 911, a guy came up and he said he saw you put something in her drink. A, a guy? What guy? I, I don't know, a guy. Um, attractive, tall, blonde hair. The police were looking for him, but I guess he left. Perfect. Do you like it? I didn't think I would, but I, I do. You look terrific. Who's this? Stop it. I love it. It's very professional. Thank you. 
I, uh, I thought it was time for a change. <laughs> Interesting. What are you doing here? You were at the restaurant that night. You drugged Emily and planted that stuff in my car. <laughs> you're insane. Really? I think you're totally obsessed with her. That's ridiculous. Look, I already told you. I'm her tutor, okay? Are you tutoring at the mall today? You followed us? Maybe I should just tell Miss Armstrong. Yeah, maybe I should report you for breaking your restraining order. You know, stalking Emily. I'm on to you. I'm going to find a way to bust you. Oh, yeah? Get lost. Don't count on it. What are you doing back here? Wait, let me guess. Uh, organizing equipment, inventorying glassware. No, I just was helping yourself, I'm sure. I have a whole list of chemicals that have gone missing during your shifts. Yeah, but that wasn't because of me. Really? What is this? Uh, I was just using that at my workstation. No, you weren't. I'm calling security. Ned? I wouldn't do that if I were you. And why not? Because you couldn't afford the scandal. All those chemicals missing under your watch? And you didn't record any of it, now did you? Yeah, that's not gonna look very good on your performance report now, will it? You're just trying to cover your little butt, aren't you? I want you out of here, now. Oh, that's great, Nedster. Wanna know why? Because I was thinking of quitting anyway. Go, before I change my mind and call the police. himself. What? <laughs> oh my God. Hey, 
Hey, sweetheart. Did I get you anything? You should try to get up and eat. Are you thirsty? <laughs> oh, sweetie. Hey there. Oh, I'm so sorry. I forgot to call you and cancel. Well, I'm sorry. Is, is everything okay? You remember the boy Steve? Uh, he, he took his own life. Oh, I'm sorry. That's awful. How's Emily? She's not doing so great, so... Please, just send my condolences. Okay. Hey. Oh, hey, I'm, I'm sorry I heard about Steve. Yeah. Listen, I completely understand if you need your space. I'll just check back later, okay? Why don't you stay for dinner? Just oh. as a thank you for everything that he's done. He might already have plans. Do you have plans? I mean, I wouldn't want to impose. Okay. Mm. This is nice. And the food is really good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you know, I should have you two over to my place sometime. I make a mean cup of instant ramen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get more sauce. You want some? Oh, I can get it. Oh no, I'll get it. That was incredible. It's just weird because um, Steve and I wrote that song together. You're lucky to have music to get you through a loss like that. I feel pretty lucky to have you. This place is so nice. It is, isn't it? And by nice, I mean expensive. Well, you have to get used to it because it's just the beginning. I feel like this is just my big dream. This is my favorite spot in the valley. You know, it reminds me of this spot that I know of also has an amazing view. I want to see it. You will. I had an amazing night tonight. 
I had an amazing night tonight, too. <laughs> oh, crap. What? My mom is home. Pull over. Get in the house. Mom, get I in the house. Explain. Right now. Please, yes. I can explain? No. no, you can't explain anything. I hired you to be her tutor, not to do whatever it is that Nothing is going on here. Nothing has happened. Nothing happened. Don't ever step on my property again. Do you understand me? Mom, get off my property. Mom! Please. Right now. Can you just tell me how long this has been going on? None of your business. Oh, this is none of my business? So how long did you plan on doing this behind my back for the entire school year? I didn't think you could handle it. I can handle Devin and his lack of professional conduct. What I cannot handle is you thinking that it is somehow okay to date a, what is he, 26? 27 year old? I'm 18, mom. And you're the one who said that I could do whatever I want, remember? to rescue you. I'm not gonna let your mom stand in our way. Come with me to Los Angeles. I'll set you up with the agent. I'll set you up with everything. Just, just trust me. I can't just leave without telling my mom. We'll call her when we get there, I promise. Okay, <sighs> okay, just, just give me a minute. Ready for this? I am. <laughs> Am? Am, I made breakfast. Emily? Hi. Hey. <laughs> What's this? It's a little gift. Oh. You've already given me so much. I know, but you deserve it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Um, shoes. Well, hiking shoes. <laughs> no, so what I was thinking was that we drive up to LA today, and then on the way up, we stop at that spot that I was telling you about. Mm-hmm. And then we can spend the night, and that way you're fresh and ready to go for the agent meeting tomorrow. Um, okay. But I'm not much of a hiker. Oh, that's okay. It's, it's easy. Anyone can do it. Sure. That sounds fun. Good. Try it on. <laughs> right now? Yeah. Okay. Just for you. Alright, so we need to think of something else to do because I keep calling over and over and over and no one's answering their phones, neither one of them. Well, did you call the police? Well, of course I called the police. They say that she's not considered a missing person because she's 18. They think she's off with some boyfriend. Besides being a tutor, he has a job, right? Yes, he works at a lab. Let's call the company. Maybe someone there can reach out to him. I, I remember him in a t-shirt one day. God, what did it say? Mul mul mulberry Labs? Mulberry Labs? Mul... There's not a mole, there's a Mulford lab. Mulford, give me that number. That could, that could be it. Hello, 
Ned speaking. Hello, yes, Devin Fletch. Can you tell me if Devin Fletch is in today? Devin? Ah, uh, he's no longer employed by Mulford. You look great. The only thing, though, is the hair. What about it? Oh, we just need to, we just need to put it up. Can you tell me when he stopped working there? Last week, I can't give you the details, work privacy laws and so forth, but um, between you and me, our inventories were a little bit light. After his shift, if you know what I mean. Let me see you. God. I love you. Well then, if you'd like my honest, off-the-record opinion, I would not trust him as far as I could throw him. No, he's a pathological liar and a thief. Stay. I'll be ready to go in just a minute. We have to find her right now. Where does he live? Oh my gosh! Where does he live? I have his address in my files! Let's go. See anyone? She looks like Emily. I'm gonna look at the computer, see if I can find anything. It says she died at Rancho Vista State Park. I've been there, there's a ton of trails. Rancho Vista, cliffs. It looks like you printed out a parking pass for Rancho Vista State Park for today. Oh my God. <laughs> Voicemail. Emily, please call me. I need to know you're okay. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. I knew you'd love it. <laughs> Anything? No. Ugh, how much further to this view? It's just up the hill. Careful. Ugh, that is so many more steps. Hey, you want to stop? I am tired, and there's like tons of blisters on my feet. This doesn't sound like you. I told you I'm not the outdoorsy type. Yeah, but we're human. We all need vitamin D. I'll take a supplement. After everything I've done for you, do you not trust that this view will be worth it? <sighs> Come on. Right up this way. Oh, just, just, uh, just give me a minute. <laughs> it's exactly like it was before. Before? What does that mean? It doesn't matter. Uh. <laughs> What'd I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> it's nice. 
Uh, but you know, I have seen the ocean before. Hey, 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 what are you doing? No, no, that's supposed to be up. That's supposed to stay up. This Stop. is supposed to Don't be up. Don't do that. No, no, but this, this is not right. Okay. <laughs> Stop, you're kind of freaking me out. So uh I'm gonna I'm gonna head back. No, no, come here. No, not yet. You can't leave yet. Let go of me. <sighs> Devin. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm just I'm I'm being a perfectionist, you know? I just I really I just want everything to be to be so perfect. You want what to be perfect? Emily, when I first saw you, I knew there was something special about you. <sighs> Devin. Emily, will you marry me? Um, wow, Devin, I had no idea that, that this was where this was going. Well, of course, I, mean, I love you and I, I know you love me. Yeah, I, I do, in a way. What does that mean? Look, I, this is all happening way too fast. Well, it's happening fast because it's meant to be. But marriage, look, I don't know if I ever want to get married. You're young. Everyone young feels that way. That's the only reason. Maybe so, but all I know is that's, that's how I feel right now. No. No, you can't say no to me. I'm sorry. You can't do this to me again. Again? If they're where I think they are, I know a shortcut. Okay. You don't understand everything that I've done for you. I, I appreciate it, Devin. I, I do. Everything I've done for your dream, and this is what you do to mine, huh? This is what you do to mine, you destroyed it. No, no, no. Don't you ignore me. Uh. Come here. No. Oh. See? See, this is nice. <laughs> go! 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 It's just me and you. It's just us, baby. It's just us, just the way it should be. <sighs> See? See? We don't need this anymore. <laughs> Come here. Get away from her! Hey, hey, who are you? Shut the hell up. Emily, I'm Jared, your mom's friend. She's coming down the trail right now. Come with me. This is not what it looks like. Shut up. Emily, come with me. Okay, okay, go, go right ahead. Go right ahead. Come, come on, your mom's coming. Your mom's coming. <laughs> my help. You never did. No, I do. I do anything, anything that you want. Please, please. Tell me you love me. I love you. I love you. Please, 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 please. Devin? Devin? <gasps> Emily is coming with me. We're going to be a family. There's nothing you can do about it. Devin, please don't hurt her. She means everything to me. She means everything to me! She's not Alexis. I'm so sorry for everything you went through. It must have been so hard for you to lose her. Just let Emily go. I want to help you. You don't want her to do what you want or what I want. If I can't have her... No one can! Devin! Come on, honey. Let's go.
So do you want to go to dinner after your showcase? Can't. I have a midterm tomorrow. But I'll be home next weekend. Cool. We'll do it then. Devin. Order up for Devin. Sorry. It's fine. Sorry, are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm just running late to chemistry. A chemistry class with Professor Grover? Yeah. I'm in that class too. Anthony. Anthony Smith. Chelsea. Nice to meet you. You know, I know a shortcut. You want me to show you? Lead the way. All right. So I'm really looking forward to this class. I'm majoring in chemistry. How about you? Sociology. I'm really terrible at chemistry. Oh, well, if you need any help, just let me know. I have experience as a tutor. I mean, I do it for free. You know, for people in the class. Thanks. I might take you up on that. <laughs>